Alrighty, so in today's video we are going to be talking about Hamza. If you don't know who Hamza is, he's pretty much a self-improvement, entrepreneur, business type man. Essentially, he makes his money through school, a platform where he invites his Adonis people or also just members, but he's labeled them as Adonises. And the opposite side, which is pretty much Jeffries, which is just a normal dude that, you know, smokes stuff you know, and just doesn't progress with his life, doesn't work out, hasn't got a girlfriend, you know, just watches P0RN, if you get what I mean, and essentially just the normal average person who has absolutely nothing. And the Adonis, on the other hand, has everything, the cars, the girls, the money, the house, and just the body, right? And essentially, we all want to be here but a lot of us are here. And the reason we watch Hamza is because we want to become a so-called Adonis. So my point in today's video is going to be talking about how to actually have a full-time job and work on a business such as creating content, getting school members into your school community. And just want to let you guys know, I have zero school community members right now. I'm opening up a 100% free community until maybe one or 200 people. If you want to join it, cool, and essentially it's going to be about self-development, fitness, building a business through content creation, and pretty much stuff like that. So if you want to, then click the first link in the description, and it's free. Right now it's free, so first 100 members, shabam, it's free forever. So there will also be courses that I'll be uploading, such as productivity systems, my workout system, my diet. I'm not a nutritionist, but you need to have... 80% diet to achieve the body that you want and 20% of the actual workout contributes to getting the body but majority of people just mess up on the diet so if you have a full-time job I'm gonna explain to you what you should be doing because this is essentially my work schedule so if I can remember to put a chart here literally I wake up at 4 a.m. every day then I have breakfast and I leave for work at 5 a.m. then I commute to work which takes about an hour then from 6 till 2, I just work my regular job. I can't do anything that I don't allow headphones, phones, whatever it may be. So you can't work on any business ideas. So after that's done, I get home at 3. Then at 3.30, which is when my pre-workout kicks in, I'm normally at the gym. By the time I come back, shower, it's 5. Between 5 and 6, I normally sit down with my girlfriend and her friends, have dinner because you need to eat to survive. 6 and 7 or 7.30, I just make these videos or I make TikToks just simply on my phone because each one takes maybe 10, 15 minutes to make between recording them, editing them, uploading them, putting them on all the platforms and making sure all the captions are correct, what you're saying is correct and it's a decent video that's good enough to upload. So essentially that's my work schedule. I'm working maybe, let's see, 12 or 13 hours and that's essentially my day every single day and on weekends I just make more content because I have more time unless I have to do overtime work which is either on Saturdays or Sundays standard 8 hour shift. So that is the raw reality of trying to make content having a full time job. With this obviously comes sacrifices which is I don't really have time for Netflix the only time I do watch Netflix is with my girlfriend we might watch a you know Big Bang show or whatever it is while we're eating but after we eat it's just back to work back to making content back to growing my audience. So if you like the raw content so far, you know, like, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. The point I'm getting at is when you have a full-time job and you're trying to make content, you're essentially gonna have no life. And the thing is, what you need to understand, if you have multiple business ventures that you actually want to do, such as you want to do drop shipping, you want to be a YouTube content creator, you want to have a social media marketing agency, you want to be a affiliate marketer, you don't have time for all of these. There's only 24 hours in a day. And if up to 60 or more percent of your day is spent at work and you still gotta commute, go to the gym, eat food, you know, poop and pee, still go shower, and you're gonna have maybe hour or two hours to yourself. And that's it. And how you spend that time needs to be extremely crucial. Because you need to understand that if you spend those one or two hours such as playing video games, watching Netflix or just doing something weird like scrolling on your phone for whatever reason because you're bored pretty much, that's why anyone does it, is you lose those one or two hours every day for a week, 
for months over a year or months you're gonna make absolutely no progress or someone who literally has no life which is what's going to happen if you're trying to do this you're gonna be working so much at your job you're gonna come home you're tired and you work more that's essentially how it is so the working one or two hours per day is the micro level and your macro is what you want to build or what is your purpose for doing this so for me on the macro level we'll go here so you got macro level and what do i want i want a porsche 911 carrera or turbo s that's what i want it's about two hundred thousand dollars how am i going to get that well i need money can i get that through my job no well how else can i do it and you can do this task too well i can build an audience through social media or just join me on school so if we actually come to my desktop if i've set this up correctly this is essentially the plan so you got school plan which is 10k per month in mrr mrr stands for monthly recurring revenue so for me to do this if i price at 27 dollars per month and we have 370 members i am now making 9990 dollars with this i'll also be doing my full-time job because more money I have that Porsches are expensive. That's essentially my plan. No matter which business model you're going for, I don't care which business model it is because essentially all of them work. If you're doing drop shipping, that works. Doing SMAA, that works. You're doing YouTubing, TikTok videos, you're making money, that works. But you don't have time for all of these. So only pick one of these because you only have time for one of these. You can't put 24 hours of work in because you need, still need to sleep, you still need to take care of your health, you still need to go to the gym. Use the pockets of one or two hours each and every single day to make micro progress towards where you're going. For me as someone who's trying to make it on YouTube, my daily task would be spend one to two hours creating content, either long form or short form. That's my task to get to my bigger macro goal. So micro task, content. Mac macro goal after doing this for months or maybe years or whatever it may be is I might have a money to buy a Porsche 911 because I have enough members in my school community which are affected from the micro level so for you it might be different for you you might be wanting to do drop shipping okay well I need to do drop shipping I need to spend one or two hours a day on it and I need to find products after I found a product I need to source it from a supplier after I sourced it from a supplier depending if you're doing TikTok organic or doing Facebook ads well I need to make 30 videos and post a video every day if you're doing organic then for Facebook ads or TikTok ads you might be like well I need to make seven different ad angles for example and I need to post them on Facebook and I need to post them on TikTok well how do we do this you make it for the ads then you got to save money for the ads. Then once that's done, you launch the ads. So if those were your micro tasks. And theoretically, if your macro goals were the same as mine, you no, know, Porsche money, pretty much. Which is these micro tasks will become this macro task over a long period of time. I'm not going to go into any other business models because essentially you get it. You do the important thing that needs to be done. You do it for X amount of time and you achieve what you want, which is a good business, you got money, and you got your dream car. But doing this requires sacrifice. Essentially, you need to stop doom scrolling, watching Netflix, playing video games, because any of these three things, that can affect the one or two hour time block at each and every single day, which are the micro distractions, they will affect your macro goal. And if these micro distractions add up, then it's gonna affect your macro goal. If you get distracted every day for three months, I'm sorry, but you failed. So just focus on one thing, stick to one thing that's literally it choose one thing and go all in on that one thing one two hours every day dedicate weekends or days off on those one things hope this makes sense like subscribe join a free community and hope you like this raw content